Grooming Your Mastiff, a Mastiff Grooming Guide. When it comes to daily chores for your Mastiff, the first thing that comes to mind is walking him on a daily basis. There is another chore that is equally important, and that is grooming your pet. Grooming includes cleaning or wiping your dog's ears and eyes, clipping the claws, brushing their coat for loose ends, cleaning their teeth and bathing them periodically as well. All these tasks do not need to be performed on a regular basis, but on a need-to-do basis. You, the Mastiff owner, are the best judge as to when your pet needs attention. Having said that, brushing their coat and checking their ears for cleanliness and infections can be done every day, as a good grooming practice. Make sure to teach your Mastiff puppy to stand tall from a very early age. Claw clipping can be a daunting task at first but you get the hang of it if you do it carefully and by staying calm and resilient. This will be sensed by your dog and he will soon become comfortable with the ritual too, and may even start enjoying it. Some of the Mastiffs even enjoy brushing and air cleaning, and with regular care, it will be an easy process for both, the Master and the pet. Whatever you do, never use force or hit the Mastiff, or else you will scare them away, possibly for life. It will only lead to frustration on your part and take more time and effort than it usually should. Patience and resilience are key to the grooming process in the beginning until it turns into a habit for both of you. Bathing and brushing drastically reduce the shedding of messy hair and reduce the body odor from your mastiff. These are good hygiene practices and also ensure that he doesn't develop any infections or ticks in the long run. If you keep his eyes clean, he is less likely to develop any infections and makes him look more adorable. Similarly, if you don't cut his claws in time, they may become uncomfortable and he may have trouble moving, and even worse, may lead to nerves growing within the claws, which can be painful when you cut them. Grooming Tips What to do When to do it How to do it Claws, nail trimming claws require clipping once every week. You can set a particular day and time every week when you and your mastiff are relatively relaxed and composed. Eyes, grooming tips for cleaning. Them mastiff size can get really messy. The loose skin around the face and eyes can worsen it. As you would expect, this is usually noticeable during the mornings. However, as mastiffs are generally lazy and sleep during the day as well, you will need to keep an eye on their eyes and clean as necessary. The eyes need cleaning for several reasons. It doesn't look pleasant, and you certainly do not want to show off your mastiff to an outsider. The dog can develop eye infections if the dirt and sticky substance stay in their eyes for a longer duration. You naturally do not feel like hugging the mastiff as they do not look pleasant and clean. And lastly, if you do not clean it, the mess will dry or get wiped on your furniture, clothes, sheets at all, you get the drift, clean the eyes gently using a piece of wet cloth that should be soft in texture. A damp toilet paper will also do the trick. It is best to use a combination of wet and soft that will be appreciated by your dog as well. You do not want to cause any irritation that may lead to infection or inflammation. Ears, if you do not clean their ears for long, you have no idea what is breeding within them. That will be the last thing you want to see or touch. Their ears are not that ventilated and after bathing or getting wet, they do not dry very quickly or properly either. As a result, the wax inside their ears stays moist for longer. This wax buildup can eventually lead to terrible infections that can be painful, irritating and interfere with their hearing. Another issue is mites and that will most probably need a visit to the vet. The ears can be washed and cleaned with the help of a soft piece of cloth. Never use cotton buds, q-tips, unless you are just cleaning the outer area of their ears. If you use it for the inner ear then you may push the wax even further and that may exacerbate the problem, and worsen the infection. For wet wax you will be well advised to use a dry cloth for better cleaning results. As long as you are only washing and cleaning the inner part of the ear that is visible to you, you cannot do any harm to the dog. Grooming tips for cleaning your mastiff's coat, brushing the coat all over the dog's body should be a daily ritual. If you do not do it on a daily basis, then you are leaving the dust, dead hair, dandruff and other bodily oils to build up and spoil the coat, or even worse, lead to skin infections. They also smell very bad if left for too long. One of the best pieces of advice is to use a dog glove that is made for short-haired dogs like Mastiffs. 
they grip well and let you groom in a natural manner when you use those hand strokes all over their body. You can also use your bare wet hands by using brushing like strokes, starting from their back area and moving forward towards the head, basically brushing him against the direction of the growth of the Mastiff's coat. This should be followed by hand brushing in the usual or opposite direction, which is when you will notice dead hair and dust extracted. Bathing, grooming tips for your favorite Mastiff. Bathing is a frequent need of a Mastiff. Depending on his activity, daily habits, and how often he stays outdoors, dogs need to be bathed in a corresponding frequency, ranging anywhere from once a week to every six to eight weeks. This breed has a short but dense coat and they require routine bathing to minimize shedding hair all over your house, and more importantly, to keep their skin and coat healthy and supple. Before you bathe them, it is a good idea to run a high-power dryer on them, to get rid of any loose coat, dirt or debris that they may be holding within their coat. If you do not have a dryer, then a slicker brush can also be a practical option. The coat will also need trimming from time to time, just like nail trimming, so they stay healthy and require less bathing. One thing is for certain and you need to be clear about it, Mastiffs do not need a daily bath like humans do, as their skin texture and type is different to ours. That will actually be counterproductive as all the fat on the skin gets eliminated which is meant to protect the coat and skin from bacteria, microbes and other related skin conditions. Some dogs may also be allergic to frequent baths, given the number of detergents that you would put on their body on a frequent basis. Always try to use hypoallergenic or chemical-free products that won't cause irritation in the long run, and avoid the urge to use human shampoo on them. You do not want your dog to have eczema, rashes or any kind of skin condition, either through chemical-based products or overbathing. A well-groomed and bathed dog will be much healthier and better looking when he gets the Mastiff grooming attention he needs. Thank you for watching on Grooming Your Mastiff Dog. We hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to our channel for more videos about Mastiff dogs.